We're back here again in the best land and today we got ourselves the Glock 19X. Just picked it up, curious to know if I like it equal to, less than, or better than my SIG M18. I think this thing looks fantastic. It feels fantastic, um, but does it shoot fantastic? That's what we're about to find out. Today for our setup, we have got the plate right here from Cal Ranch, the main one. And today we're gonna try something new in, in the trees. I don't know if we'll be able to get it, but we'll try. This is gonna be my first five rounds with the Glock 19X. A little bit about this firearm. This was Glock's submission to the modular handgun system for the US Army, for the military. It did not win, unfortunately. You know my boy, the M18? Yeah, he won. But this was a pretty close second, I would imagine. This is the first five shots, and we're gonna see how much I like it, or don't like it. We got our first jam right off the bat. Noted, first round jam. Let's see if it does it again. It was so I took it out of the box. I put oil on it, some grease on the slide. Just did, not like cleaned it, but I lubed it. And um, let's try this again. This is the second round out of five. I'm gonna be aiming for the Red Bull can, just to the right of the plate. And let's see if I can hit it. Yeah. I would say I like this gun a lot. All right, now we're gonna just go, just go for the plate. Yep, she's good. <laughs> we got three rounds of nine here. First shot with the 19X from me. We're gonna see how we do. It's just nice, <laughs> dude. That was just bad on my part, but I really freaking like this gun. All right, Jackson's first three shots with the 19X. Jan, so just pull the slide back, then last shot, hit that plate. It's fire, man. It's fire, bro. Got the P320 with the RMR on it and the extendo dick. We're gonna do a little draw action here. Maybe not. This is a good gun. Back in 2018, when Britton and I started getting into guns, this was the first gun that that I guess Britton purchased with some gift cards, and it is a Stoger 12 gauge shotgun. And we would go to the very, very top of this canyon, and we would blast stuff like cans and other things. Today we're gonna be going back to 2018 in a sense, and we got some sparkling water cans, and uh, we're gonna do some, like essentially clay pigeon throwing, with some cans and the 12 gauge shotgun. Don't believe me, you can ask her. Hey, going back shit in the backseat. Rain, she was off my property, you stupid bitch. Hey, bring that ass, Mimi. That thing did oh. crazy. Bruh. That blew that thing. That's, that's gone. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Alright, throw it. Throw it. <laughs> Fee, fa, fo, fum, motherfucker. That's why we carry a shotgun around the house, baby.
Not in my house. This this <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with it? Oh. You didn't <laughs> All I can say is fuck this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> These bitches are bugging. <laughs> Goodness. Nice day for some target practice, am I right? So, that didn't cycle. What's she doing? So, this is my first time with the 17 round mag and I'm glad that I practice it. Oh, did I hit that? No? I don't think so. Am I going high or what? I think high. This mag is doing some weird things. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so I have used almost 45, I think 45 rounds through this. And my initial thoughts are if I'm going really slow with the gun and I'm taking my time, I really like it. But if I'm trying to be quick, I am not very good at hitting things. I'm, I'm going to blame that on the fact that I just don't have the best love of the Glock trigger. It's not a bad trigger. I'm just a P320 trigger person. I'm going to try to show you what I mean, I'm gonna do one really slow shot at the just the recent, the closest gong, and then one trying to be a little bit quicker, and we'll see what happens. This one is the slow. So even on the slow, we did not hit. Let's try quick now. So that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> so there's no more in here as you can tell one round in the chamber. I'm gonna try to go for the top far gong and I'm telling you now I'm not gonna hit it. Oh my gosh. Huh, interesting. <laughs> so my conclusion, my concluding thoughts on the Glock 19X after shooting it, I don't know how I feel. Sometimes I've been mad at this gun. Sometimes I have enjoyed this gun. Time will tell, I suppose.